thing wrong. Gotta get ready to enjoy the view. Looking kinda cool, looking kinda new. There are things we should be trying, me and you. A new day's here and fun is overdue. Getting even cooler, stepping to a new beat. Got a tingling inside me and it's spreading to my feet. McDonald land is changing. Everything is rearranging. I can't sit still, cause it's a beautiful day. And Ronald McDonald's got something to say. Now good morning in McDonald land. Let's see what's happening first. Oh, Sunday, it's me. Oh, sorry, Ronald. Hey, you're gonna give yourself nightmares watching that stuff. Well, I can't stop now. The dinosaurs are eating their way through Central Park. Is that Attack of the Dinosaurs? Why didn't you tell me I love that movie? If you hadn't sat on that dinosaur egg, you this mess. I did it for science! Yeah, nice work, Doctor. Your science project has us. I'm gonna have to switch to sugar-free dog food. Oh, hey, someone's calling on the picture full. I'll get it! I'll get it! Hi, Ronald. Oh, hi, Tika. What's up? Well, it's a really nice day, and winter's right around the corner. So I was wondering if you and the gang might want to go camping together out in Farflung Forest. Great idea. Fresh air, campfires, and I can try out my new tent and a flashlight invention. So you're up for it? Oh, sure, Tika. I'm going to go check out my breezeometer. Weather's perfect for a camp out. Hold on a minute, Ronald. Camping in the woods? Are you sure? Sunday, don't tell me you're afraid of giant dinosaurs. No, no, it's, uh, ticks. I don't like ticks and fleas. Oh, Sunday. Call the gang and have them meet us at the car in five minutes. Thanks, Ronald. This is going to be a trip we'll never forget. I don't like the sound of that. Hey, Grimace, what's up? Ronald, I can't watch any more TV. No, it's scary. Now, every channel I turn to is movies with vampires and monsters and baby dogs. Well, why don't you join me and the gang? We're going camping. Camping? In the woods? What other kind of camping is there? Uh, I don't know, Ronald. What kind? <sighs> Ronald? Oh, are you still there? Oh, uh, there's the other line, Grimace. Meet us at the car as soon as you can. Hey, Sunday, can you find that new flashlight we were working on? Okay, Ronald. Another day in McDonald land. Ronald McDonald! You will <laughs> never believe it! What, Birdie? Aliens, Ronald! Aliens! I'm certain a spaceship came down and took away my bird bath. It was oh. here one minute and gone the next. Sounds like someone's been watching some scary movies lately. Hey, we're going camping in the far-flung forest. Want to go? Sounds fun. So long as you don't beam me up to any spaceship. Actually, I thought we'd take the car. Meet us there in five minutes, okay? Okay, Sunday. Let's see how that new tent and a flashlight invention works. I don't suppose you'd consider checking me into a kennel instead. Oh, come on, Sunday. I got a new pup tent for you in the car. Far flung! Here we come! Man, 
you gotta get some stairs. That used to be fun. <laughs> Carrying all of you? You're the car. Well, don't blame me when I sprain an axle. Just what we need. Dual airbags and an attitude problem. I hope you least. wanted to go camping in far Flung forest, but I've always been too afraid. Uh, afraid? What? Who? Oh, it's probably nothing. It's just, well, I've heard stories. About what? No, don't tell me. The far-flung phantom. A ghost that walks the night and preys on unsuspecting campers. Now, this is my kind of story. The way I hear it, the phantom lives in some spooky old house. And whenever campers get near it, they get swept away by floods. <gasps> Sounds perfectly awful! Uh, what she said. And they get lost. Forever. Uh. It's okay, Grimace. I've been camping in far-flung forests for years. <laughs> I haven't seen any phantom. That's because nobody's ever seen the phantom. And lived. Well, let's go home, Ronald. What's the matter, scared? Don't worry, Grimace. Their story's made up for the campfire. What we need for the car is a good driving song. There's nothing like the great outdoors and the far-flung forest is the best, of course. If you want to get close to the greenery, then camping in the wild is the place to be. There's flowers. And squirrels. And fish. And frogs. With lots of bugs. Hey, Ronald, are we there yet? No. There's nothing like the great outdoors, and the far flung forest is the best, of course. If you want to get close to the greenery, then camping in the wild is the place to be. There's flowers, and squirrels, and fish, and frogs, caves, and rocks. With lots of bugs. Hey, Ronald, are we there yet? No! There's nothing like the great outdoors and the park long forest is the best, of course. If you want to get close to the greenery, then camping in the wild is the place to be. There's flowers. And squirrels. And fish. And frogs. Caves and rocks. And lots of logs. Looking for a bird. Laying in the trees. I hope a bird doesn't come for me. So, Ronald, are we there yet? No! There's nothing like the great outdoors and the far-flung forest is the best, of course. If you want to get close to the greenery, then camping in the wild is the place to be. There's flowers and squirrels and fish and frogs, caves and rocks and lots of logs. There's flowers and squirrels and fish and frogs and caves and rocks and lots of logs. So, Ronald, are we there yet? Okay, everybody, find a buddy. Sunday's with me. Tika, you dropped something. Oh, yes, well, I brought this walkie-talkie in case we split up. We could stay in touch, but, oh, darn it, where's that other one? Oh, that's weird. Uh, we thought you might need an extra body, Grimace. Oh, sure. Hop in. <laughs> squirrel. Come on, Sunday. It's just a squirrel. <laughs> You're right, 
like Ronald. It's just a squirrel. A very nice squirrel. 